At this point, you've seen a couple of different photochemical processes and photosensitization is just one more. So after a molecule has undergone photo excitation, absorbing energy through a photon, um, it can give that energy off again in a number of ways. It can give off a photon, either through a resonance phenomenon in which it gives off the same wavelength photon as it initially took in, or it can give off slightly smaller amounts of energy through fluorescence or phosphorescence. In radiationless relaxation, there's no photon given off at all, but instead the molecule either undergoes vibrational quenching, giving off tiny amounts of energy to vibrational states, essentially losing that energy as heat, or completely transferring all of its energy to a second molecule at once, and that's photosensitization. So a molecule called a photosensitizer um, can absorb a photon, and at some point, if it collides with another molecule, it can transfer all of its energy over to that second molecule. In this case, the photosensitizer has already undergone intersystem crossing, so it's a triplet state at this point, and it is uh, transferring its energy to the other molecule, which is also excited as a triplet state here. Photosensitization is important because it allows molecules that can't absorb photons themselves to be indirectly excited through this intermediary, this photosensitizer. 